Welcome to The Learning Project. I'm your host, Stephanie Courtney, and you are going to be joining us for a special segment that's focusing on art and teaching diversity. Join us and learn more today. Why is this so important to you guys? Like, um, what was it that, or maybe even a child or a situation that you have um, dealt with, you're like, we need this content out there in the world so that we can make an impact on, on these little ones? Well, one thing that I think about every day about why this is important is just the real world implications that this is having on students of color every yes. single day. Like you look at the disproportionate amount of black students that are um, that are suspended, that are given mm -hmm. detentions, that have police school resource officers, police officers in schools calls on them. Just every single day there are real implications to educators not doing the work and understanding their biases and that is dangerous and so harmful yeah. and so that every single day I think about that and think about when I log on to Facebook or to Instagram and I see these teachers saying stuff like this doesn't have anything to do with art education and mm. think about what happens to all these students that every single day face these real world things because of bias. So um, that's something that makes me angry and um, pushes me to continue to do the work and to have these conversations with educators. To add when, to your original question about where art plays into all of this is that Art education is so powerful when we're talking about these things, not only for the representation in artists, but because the art classroom and art is a space where you can really talk about and bring in issues from all different things. In my elementary art classroom, we've done projects about race, about indigenous peoples, about immigration, about human rights, about climate change. The art room really, really lends itself more than any other subject or more than any other space really um, in an elementary classroom to be able to talk about these complex issues and yeah. to provide a space for students to think through these things through making art. And um, I think that art educators can be a really powerful tool in the elementary school or middle school mm -hmm. or high school, but especially elementary, to yeah. provide a space and a place and a, a means and tools to be able to talk about all of these issues. Like, I'm about to explode right now. This is amazing. I, I think the work that you're doing right now is so relevant. It is going to transform the way we do education. I mean, really even just that that the page that you're talking about that's going to go over you know if you hear something this is how you can address it this is what you could talk about you know like sometimes people just need the words and for you to be able to extend that olive branch and say this is how you can do it i think that is priceless um, one of my favorite quotes that i always say something uh, that i always say is if you see something say something um we have to be in that state, you know, a mind to help hold people accountable, um, but also come from that place of love so that when they do have those those biases and those those things that are keeping us from having genuine connections with our with our students, they can come to somebody, have a safe space to lay those ignorance pieces down. Even sometimes you don't even know it's an ignorant thought that you may have um, and be able to really um, get some solutions. Um,